Hi, my name is Elle McCann from Curious Themes Web Development Studio in Nashville, Tennessee. And in this video tutorial, I'm going to walk you through how to find the best theme for your Shopify store. So right now I am in the back end of Shopify. So this is what you'll see whenever you first log in. And I'm going to click online store in the left hand menu. And then you can see now we're under the themes area. So debut is a free theme with Shopify that's included whenever you set up your Shopify store. And actually in the next video that I'm recording, I'll go through how to customize that. However, this one we're gonna go through setting up a free theme. So you can preview what it looks like now by hitting this view your store. So we haven't customized anything yet, but you can see the kind of general overall look and feel of it. There's different areas for products and you can add even more areas like Instagram um, and a blog, things like that. However, if you want it to be a little bit more stylized, the free theme that is included with Shopify is a little bit more uh, minimalistic. So if you wanted to do a more designed theme, you can go in to the Shopify theme store. So to do that, I'm just gonna go to shopify.com, which I have set up already here. And if you go under resources, you can go to the theme store. So the theme store are pre-designed themes that are a little bit more stylized that you can still customize with your own branding and colors. And you can sort through, there's so many different options of them. So we'll go up here and you can see under collections, there's different collections of themes that you can do. Also they're done by industry. Uh, but to see the free themes that are there, you can go under all themes. And under this price field, you'll be able to select free. Now, a lot of the themes in here that are really nice and stylized are paid and they really range in the, the pricing of it. Um, but you can now see all of the different free themes that are available and you can further limit how many uh, things you're searching for in terms of looking for a free theme that also has the capability and looks really good with just a single product. So now you've got that set up. So let's say you want to add one of these themes to your store. You will just select the theme you want. Oh, that's the debut one. Let me go back. We already have that one. So I'll do this narrative. And you can see different stylized versions of it here. And then you can just say, start with this theme. You would log into your store. Okay, and then now it has it set up to where you can either publish it automatically or install it as an unpublished theme. So if you already have a store that's live, you'll wanna make sure that you, pub you install it as an unpublished theme. This way you can go in and customize it before you actually make it live. So there's no kind of downtime for your current site. But if you, however, if you haven't launched yet, you can just hit publish as my store's theme. So I'm gonna say install as an unpublished theme. And this is going to actually install it into your back end of Shopify. So where we were first when we saw the debut theme, we'll actually see that in there now. So we'll go to my themes manager. And you can see that now we have it under this more themes. So you can actually click into here and you can go in and, and customize it from there. And I did want to show, so if we go back to the Shopify theme store, so we'll go under theme storm. There are a lot of really cool design options. So if you pick one, like for example, this one that has a really cool grid style, if you pick it, you can actually, if you already have a store set up with products, you can always hit this um, preview in your store or you can go to the view demo button. So if you click the view demo, you can actually see how the site looks in terms of how you know the homepage looks, the blog, things like that. So it's more than just seeing the screenshot. And if you did wanna purchase it, um, you'll see where you can now hit buy theme if it's a paid theme and you can see that this one's 180. 
So there definitely is a lot of different options. Now, the biggest thing in terms of choosing your theme design, especially if you're going to go with one that's paid, is making sure that you pick one that really kind of works with your branding and the type of products you have. You know, if you have 200 something products, then you're going to want to have a theme that better suits that and, you know, has good categorization of like a side menu versus if you have just a few products, you could go with a different theme. So I've actually put together a theme checklist of things to kind of think through in terms of how you want your site to look, maybe look at some inspiration sites first and kind of figure out how you want it to look first before you go downloading themes or purchasing themes and customizing it. So you can kind of make sure you do it once and then that's good to go. So I have the link to download that theme checklist below this video. And then in the next video, I'm going to actually go through how to go in and customize the, uh, the debut theme. So it would be the same settings that you would go through and customize any theme, whether it's a different free theme or a paid theme. And I'll include the link to that video below this video so that you, once you have your theme picked out, you can instantly go in and follow along with me as I customize it. Thanks so much for watching and subscribe to get more videos like this all about Shopify.